Hello, my name is Mary Decatur with the X-Ray Application Support Team. Today, I'd like to take a few minutes to walk you through how to apply a DNG profile created with the Color Checker Passport to multiple images out of the bridge and using Camera Raw. To begin with, I've already generated my profile. It's been created, so I have relaunched my application and I'm now in Bridge. And what I'm going to do here is select multiple images to apply the profile to by simply clicking and holding down the control key on a Windows system or the Alt key on a Mac. I'm then going to do a right click and select Open in Camera Raw. Now you'll notice I have multiple images opened at the same time. Normally, when I'm doing my own workflow and my own editing, I'll go through and I'll create one image that I'm making multiple adjustments to as far as the white balance or my exposure, recovery, fill light, etc. For this example, I'm simply going to be showing you applying the camera profile. So now we're going to select the, the main image, which is at the top. I've now clicked Camera Profile, or excuse me, Camera Calibration. I'm going to go down to Camera Profile and select the profile I'd like to apply to my image, which in this case is named Canon July Keegan Daylight. Canon, of course, for the type of camera. My daughter's name is Keegan, and the daylight was the lighting conditions. So I'm going to go ahead and select that and if you'll notice there is a slight shift, some deeper saturation. At that point I would finish doing my, most of my edits but it, it, for this case I'm not going to be doing anything further so I'm going to go ahead and click on my select all box. Once that box has been selected I'm now going to click synchronize. This is going to bring up my main synchronization settings. As you can see, there's many different options that you can synchronize, but for the purpose of this video, I'm going to go ahead and select only camera calibration. I'm going to now say OK. And as you can see by the small icon that's being applied to the profile, my profile has now been added to each one of these images. Sometimes I do like to go down and make sure that I do like the results and so I'll scroll through to make sure that I'm getting the results that I would like to see with that particular profile or with those edits. And that's how simple it is applying a color checker passport profile to multiple images using Camera Raw and the bridge. Thank you. Goodbye for now.